what is good we are back once again hopefully you guys can hear me okay i am your host king giovanni we're going in with once again another fcc boomers tournament series this time number five going in with dnf duel happy sunday everybody let's get it in i'm gonna hop into the commentators booth and introduce our co-commentator for the day what is good no name can you hear me yep blood and good Did you mute or Oh, sorry, I can hear you for a second there. My name's No Name. I'm about four years in the FGC and looking to watch some good old DNF after a while. <laughs> yep, no worries. Some new Discord update is uh, interesting to say the least. <laughs> already scouting out the lobby and I see two Swift Master avatars so I'm a bit worried. I do not do well against that character. You guys should be able to hear me now. My software, everything was starting to act up because of Discord update real quick. No, Nate, can yep. you hear me? Uh, I can still hear you. All right, sounds good. All right. One second, let's see. All right. Should be able to see that. Can you see that? Is it like... Yeah. Looks like that's working, so that's nice. Hopefully that'll fix the uh, Discord streaming issues. All right, so we should be able to get it started. So first up, we're going to have Rian versus um, Abermack. Hopefully I'm pronouncing his name right. I do remember seeing Abermack join a while back. I believe he's rocking Grappler, correct? I believe so. Also, you can see I got the FGC Boomers the merge. merge going on. Yep. <laughs> yep. I still need to get my hands on some of that. Yeah, I know. I believe Reeland got has placed second pretty consistently at the DNF bracket. So it'll be interesting to see how this goes. Is he still rocking the uh, Ranger or Ranger? Did he switched to his profile. Ranger and Hitman is from one I'm last been seeing. Okay. Yeah, I'm not sure how well Ranger does against uh, Swiftmaster. So, although I do believe it'll be probably Ranger versus Grappler, correct? So, probably that so. does not sound fun. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, see if I can hop in, get it started. There's that guy. Great. 
I, I don't think they've done a balance patch for this game yet, have they? No, not yet. It's supposed to be coming up. Okay. I know I took a small break, so I was wondering if that got added while I was gone. Yeah, it's supposed to be coming in real soon. Like, it's not next week. They, cause they said the end, the end of August, and we're pretty much at the end of August. Yeah, this is basically the end of August, so <laughs> hope that comes in soon. Definitely be interesting to see how they go there. Mac is on its way. It looks like he just saw the. Yeah, he just saw the pin. All right, there yeah, he is. Just... Alrighty, let's get right into it then. Yeah, I remember. I believe Black Alpha actually talking about Grappler v. I don't launcher. How that was very not fun for Grappler, so I can only imagine what Grappler v Ranger will be if that uh, turns out yeah. to be the character choice here. Because like to me, like um, Ranger is like the better version of Launcher. Launcher, Launcher <laughs> had his, has her problems. Ranger can do a little bit, a little bit more than she can. Yeah. Oh, Hitman. Surprisingly, I think Grappler does much better here because DP is just. Yeah, not as impactful in this matchup, especially when he but can hit. counter. Or... I guess he can't counter after reacting to the first hit of DP because it's too tight for his counter to work there. Mm -hmm. But he can counter on wake up for the first hit of DP, and he can just armor through it, I believe, with his many, many armor moves. <laughs> yeah. So I, guess we'll see I think Rian also out. probably going for the random fact that dude, the Hitman doesn't care about randomness. <laughs> Hitman doesn't mind if he's at like 2% HP, he's still playing the same game. Yeah, right respecting the frame. Ooh, tried to jump out on the four matter. Uh, right into the corner. Oh, nice, got the roll right there. Ooh, yeah, that's big. Oh, didn't crouch it. party time. Oh, oh he dropped no. it though. Yeah, that combo's really awkward to get. You have to start charging at a really weird time to get that to hit, but it does work. Okay, save him. And plus frame, oh, oh but he matched for the plus frame to get out there. Yep. I'm guessing that was a counter, but counter does have startup frame, so it's probably too late. Oh, nice. there oh, it is. Crap. You might die. Oh, he didn't optimize, though. I think he was with the pixel. Yeah. You don't want to give Hitman at least the pixel health. Yeah. He didn't op Oh, no. Tried to go Come for the boys. Frame. Oh, he knew. Oh, he went for the armor. They still got the meter port. Okay, yeah, respecting it. Oh, but he doesn't care. <laughs> he still had the man for one more. Like, hey, why not, right? Yeah, that was a very close game, run one, so. That's another thing about Grappler is that, I mean, you can basically invalidate all of his armor with Lowe's, because even while he's in his armor state, Lowe's will blow through it. But he has such good ways to be, like, very long range those like Hitman Sweep, by just that move right there, charge jump S. Didn't judge the distance on, like, quite enough, though. So. Oh, cuts it short because he's run out of meters, so he takes the first game. Yup. Real and taking game one. Yeah, round one was looking much closer, but after that, it was, uh, not quite as. Give me a second. Yeah, I don't like the. <laughs> I keep replay thing. Same. So, I'll do Home some controller. real quick play by way. play. So, Shim isn't missing too much, just basic. Reeland's gotten a pretty basic hit in so far. Not big. Oh, never mind. Okay, Reeland's on the offensive now. So. Yeah, Avermack tried to wake up with that, and... Oh. Well, for those of you who are watching, it was looking like a perfect... Yeah, wasn't a perfect, but ended with full health, so it had some great health there, but... Avermack couldn't get any decent hit in. Avermack whiffs a 2S at like point blank range and eats a combo for his troubles. So 
looks like. Well, it looks like real and take game two, so the uh, replay troubles get sorted out. So we're back. You said real and take game two? Yep, so it's currently 2 0, but Art does have another shot and he opens up very strong, but looks like he tried to armor through the DP, but timed it poorly and did not get it. Yup, there's that counter. That counter really not a great wake up option for a grappler, honestly. Oh, grab the startup of charge throw. Avermax seems to be trying to armor through much more because it doesn't look like Ruin's been representing with low too often. Oh. Ooh, also really big whiff punish, but it doesn't quite react fast enough. Oh, oh armored anti air. Oh, the loop? Okay, get some charge. Bro, that's 50%, that is... 50 right the there. I keep trying to armor through the DP with the charge throw, and I do believe that works, but it's really awkward at the time because it really it does lose out on the super armor at the end. Ah, uh, tries to stand mid low and yup. Man, that was yeah, that was game three. Oh, well, real and taking it, three zero. -oh. It's a very strong start to the bracket. Yeah. So yeah, you're well, up next, homie. Yep. Wish me luck. We'll be back. We're gonna breast off some Dragonite. Um, I think Dragonite versus Hitman. Did better than I thought I did against Diamond. You did all right. Like Hitman is Hitman's pretty tough. So you, it's hard to sometimes it's hard to tell when that string is ending. Sometimes it's just better off just blocking. Yep. Dragonite versus Hitman. See how it goes. See if no names actually been been playing. I know we all kind of like took a break from the game, waiting for that patch update. Hey, are we gonna start the run off? Spectator catch up. <laughs> all right, so we in. Nice user conversion. I'm guess get block on that. No, caught him with the instant overhead. Fly combo. We Magneto right now. Oh, he dropped the combo. That rush is kicking in. Not an awakening yet, but now he is. Oh, he just didn't have enough. This might be it right here. Oh, he drops it. So we DP through those. Didn't have the meter to call the boys, so otherwise that'd have been game. Get used to the far range of folks that are actually keep no name at bay right now. Oh, jab to the pressure. Round one goes to Daco. So, let me update the names. I'm gonna apologize about that. All right, there we go. Now we in there. Nice challenge. Oh, he drops it. Let's say he has. Dragon I can do that damage. You take that. Attack takes the first game. See if no man can wake up and work off this rust. We'll start out with the low 2S. Nice pick up. 
I'm a guess. Block the DP. Give the, the punish time. To get the corner carry right here. Yes, sir. Yo, look at this damage. And cuts it short right before awakening. I right, still this turn right there. Yep. Burnt all this meter though. Oh no, he put him in awakening just like that. Oh no, pickup. Oh, dash up to try to spec two A right there. Are we in there? Oh, doesn't block the double high overhead. All right, round one goes to no name. Starting to wake up a little bit. Are we going in right off the bat? Loop's going. So look at that guard meter. It's just like that. It's down to two bombs. Oh, clipped him. Expecting uh, the cross up right there. Look like it. Gotta use the guard button sometimes. Oh, caught him pushing the button. Gonna hurt. Oh, drops it though. Catch him with the instant overhead. This should be. I think he has enough to kill right here. Got one more. Yes, sir. That's it. That Dragonite damage. All right. One game apiece. Everything my Dragonite, like, once she gets a hit in, like, she has full, like, wall-to-wall, -wall, like, combos. And then once she gets you in the corner, she has at least 150 meters. The way she gains mana back, it, it's like OV sometimes. Oh, should be a punch. Oh. Yeah, she wasn't ready for that. Nice interrupt. Good counter hit start. Got the short. Goes into the instant overhead. Do a chunk. Nice cuts short. Trying to avoid getting him to waken him. Face the DP. Oh, big damage. Better finish it. Nice turnaround from no name these last three rounds. Oh, we DP those. Nice start. He's been doing it. He's been started with that. With that thing, 6S. Caught him with the high again. He might have enough. Oh, drops it. That, that's unfortunate. All the boys. Oh! Still my turn. Oh, he just, he just needed the, the six, 6 B right there. No, the 4 B. He's right into the super. Doesn't matter that 2 a two A right there. All right, no name goes up 2 1. Oh, starts out the 2B again. That's such a good range on that. All right, conversion is up off the 5S. Oh, we we'll in there. Should be a decent 60% right here. Maybe 65. Oh, drops it, but lands right into the instant overhead setup. Oh, you still let it rock. We ain't cutting it short. We're going for that max damage. Calling the boys. Oh. Caught him not blocking. Wow. Point blank right there. Backs away from the TP. Nice use of the movement and the conversion to keep himself safe. Clipped him with the jump A right there. Oh, drops it though. I'll try to go for the heavier combo instead of just keeping it simple right there. Oh, caught him with the long range 2A. Nice pickup. Because of the starter, it's going to be hard to tell. This might be close. Let's see. Will it kill? I think it's going to be a little bit of life left. It killed. <laughs> Yo, that Dragon Knight damage. No name takes it 3-1.
So, uh, I may or may not have forgotten the throw command. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, it was okay. We got the American resets. GG's. Yeah, that was a good way to start. Definitely had me terrified of the uh, DPs on Wake Up once I got into Awakening, so. GG's all around. I should, why it's not sending me back to the room. Yeah, oh, I think uh, that guy has some other. Oh, okay, that's what happened. Okay, all right. Check the results here. Okay. Just, uh, there we go. Alrighty then, so I believe we've had some matches going on in the background. I believe we've had Hammer, I believe that's pronounced, versus Twa Nun, I believe. Yeah, I was trying to figure out how to say that. Or two in one. I think it's two in one, one. Two in one. That does make more sense. Yeah, it took me, I was like, I was like, pause that. It was like, wait, what is that? Hold okay. <laughs> I'll decipher it real quick. <laughs> All right, so next up, we're going to have Rian versus 2 and 1 1. All righty. Rian showing a very strong set around one of the brackets. So, just going to see how that goes. I'm not sure who 2 and 1 plays, so, it'll be interesting to see that. Oh, they do have the launcher avatar though, so but that, you're gonna you see know, some launcher. You know, launcher is best waifu though, so that's yeah, that's... launcher's your girl. But unfortunately, so... unfortunately, she's just not up to up to par of what she should be. Maybe next. Yeah, match. I'm rocking Maybe the shirt. You... <laughs> How's he in the chat? Hell yeah. Yeah, I know. Specifically, remember Black Elf was really representing with her, but. It was just too hard to work. Will we see the low tier hero, hero here? This will be interesting to see. All right, looks like we're going into it. So I, have you seen Reel and Pull Out? Ranger recently, or has he mostly just been doing Hitman? I don't, last time I seen Ranger was in the the last tournament against Lane, and then he went to Hitman to try to close it out, but um, it wasn't wasn't working because you know Lane's gonna be Lane. Yeah, Lane's got it on lockdown. Oh, we do see the launcher. Oh, nice. Okay, all right, all right. So I do remember. I forget who this was. I believe it was Diaphone saying this is a really bad matchup for Hitman until. I think it was Justin Wong versus Ramola. And like, okay, maybe it's not that bad. <laughs> so I, I'm curious to see how this will go because Hitman definitely striving in that mid range, but Bontra having some tools to keep him right out of that. So we have to see how that works out. Oh, oh, uh, oh. Button issues? Controller issues, maybe. Oh, okay. all right. Looks like it was resolved. It was just the mind game. Oh, yep. Oh, okay. A little bit of spaghetti to start it out. Was that plus? That didn't the, feel so the, the, the jump, The jump B is, is plus. Well, it's like either plus or even. Okay. Oh, we got the corner combo. Ooh. We have enough mana to extend it. Oh no, they put him into Awakening. Oh, they got greedy for the damage. Oh no. Yeah, this could be game. Oh. They dropped it. Wow. Oh, but it the DP. Oh my goodness, that's it. Oh no. And she has low health. Just, he he oh. need all of that. Yeah, he, he could have ended that like five seconds earlier. Yeah, off the first 4S, he could have went right into the super and ended it. That's so unfortunate. Bro. Man, that was, yeah, you hate to see it. But reeling, coming out in the scramble, coming out on top. Yeah, that DP down the combo is very unfortunate because I guess that's one issue with Launcher that all of her pressure really strives on Grey Life. Yeah. Hitman doesn't care about Grey Life. He can just sit there and block all day. Like, all right, I mean, I'm in Awakening and half my health bar is White Life, so I've got nothing but benefits now. 
Oh, I think there was too much scaling to get that uh, link in there. Yep. Oh, oh doesn't block, block the jump in. in. Probably looking for an extra jump low. I will he say the though, launch is, yeah, launch is guard cancel is surprisingly good because it's a slide and goes very fun. Tried to press buttons off throw. Don't throws feel like... It feels like you're plus when you get throw. But like... Yeah. So... You, you wake up... You, you're like... It's weird. You're like... I think you're waking up like negative one. But if you tech the grab, if they go to grab you and you tech the grab, you're plus one. No, you're plus two. Oh, I was wondering why every time you tech one, because I don't think I've like ever been able to throw you. Every time you tech, I just eat a five and I'm like, ah, that makes more sense now. I actually, two on one can turn it around. Two in one one. <laughs> two in one one. <laughs> trying to decipher the match. Get started on the plus run, but. Yeah, so they're gonna get a lot of mileage off the of 5A. Hey, like that's that's gonna be their bread and butter in this, especially in this matchup. You gotta keep Hitman at bay. Got such a beefy hitbox, it helps a lot. And it doesn't have a ton of whiff, so even if uh, Reeland reads it into the jump in, 2 and 1 1 should be safe. I want the jump grab. Great anti air. Yeah, it looks like 2 and one, one learned her lesson after that. Oh, oh, went for two meteors. I mean, two missiles. Wow, we got the nukes out there. That was smart. But the, look how much, because it's 80, it's 80 meter for that. So they just burnt 160 meter. Oh, uh, I don't I don't know if that super is a good idea. Oh, wait, never mind. That does re... Oh, wait, this actually might be a good idea. Because this does reset to neutral at a very long yep. distance. Oh, they thought it would kill. Oh wow, no! no. <laughs> From that oh, range. Does that only stagger on counter hit? Oh, the slide. Yeah, it's only 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 on counter hit. But what it is is he hit them with the very clip of it, so he couldn't get much off of it. But if you really clipped them with the, the second hit of the homies, and then you'd be able to dash oh, yeah. up and combo. Yeah, that would have been game. That looks like uh, two and one is kind of a bit safer now, but. Nice. Ooh, we yeah, airborne out of the air. Can't block airborne. Another thing with launcher is that you can get by so much for stuff by just rolling. But yep. she does have that 5 a to stop rolls. It's just not the most reward for your troubles. And of course, if you jump over it. Oh, still my turn. Oh no. Yeah, that counter hit's gonna lead to a good bit. Thankfully, non-awakening hitman doesn't. Oh that crossed God. up. That I got cro hit. That looked I like you wouldn't have crossed up. Yeah, I wasn't holding the block button there. I got hit by that. Nice. The answer to the round start 5 a is to jump over it. Yep. I uh, wasn't close enough for the the five the five B to connect right there. This is gonna be hard for two one because closing it out is like launcher can do good damage in the corner if you got a ton of mana, but getting that hit is trouble at look. Trouble to the least. Also, they're getting clipped with the knowledge check right now because Hitman, when you think Hitman's pressure is done, it just keeps going. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta wait. Yup. And while Hitman does get plus rooms off that 6ms, the sword toss, he is very far away, but it is kind of hard to press because. Hitman sweep is just so fast, so long range. I didn't even realize he was an awakening, oh no. He is out of mana though, and... Oh, the punish! Oh, no. yeah. uh. That hurts. Yeah, that's dead. That's game two. Ooh, yup. He, he could have literally been on the other side of the screen, that would have hit. Hitman super full screen. You think Launcher would also have a full screen super since the majority of her moves are ranged moves, but no, nah, it's probably think, almost right? blank, point blank. Pretty sure Dragon Knight super is like triple the size of Launcher super. Wow, oh, two, two B beat the 5A, that's ridiculous. Is Sweep faster than Launcher 5A? It is not, but it. I guess it just low profiled it. 
Maybe. From that range. <laughs> From round start, low profile. Yup. Good old Hitman. Yeah, two and one. Not quite. I'm guessing he tried to up forward there. So. Yeah. Nice. Caught yep. him out of the road this time. Can't close it out though. Oh, she's actually kind of lucky that super that uh, magical didn't hit her beat awakening and speak of the devil. Yo, oh, he's, 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 he's trying to he's, he's trying to he's gamble he's, with the with the four S right there to try to go for the super. Oh, oh, oh. he could have had it right there. Oh no. Two of them one looking for that sweet. Oh, is. yo, there that's it. Is. it. Yeah, two of them was looking for that earlier, I believe, when he got hit by that super, trying to get that sweep into super confirm. Uh, for a second, I thought that didn't kill. I was about to be really sad. <laughs> there's no way. She does low damage, but there's no way. That's fixed damage. Yeah, I'm say all super the 200 unscaled, which is ridiculous that they did that. I know. Every time, like, okay, well, I'm just gonna do it in hope. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's again, yes, sir. So if Rio actually dashes after the second, I mean after the first 4S into the second 4S, um, Hitman has a, 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 a like a super ambiguous cross up setup afterwards. Yup. Really but it's so hard to get that there. micro dash for the second 4S. Oh, nice break. Yup. Another unfortunate thing about launcher is her her reversal is so slow that it's so easy to like the the bait it. Yeah, surprising amount of characters have pretty slow DPS in this game. Which why Dragonite is so good is that it just comes out so quickly. Nice on roll. Oh, wasn't ready for the combo though. Ooh, gets clipped by the DP. Yup. That six skill from Hitman goes so far so fast. It's always ambiguous whether you whether you have enough space to press buttons or not. Are we in there? That should be game. Yup. Yeah, burning all the bar. Just trying to close it out. Alright, well, Reelin taking it. 3 0. Looks like Reelin will be moving on. I believe our losers we've got um, Abermac, 2 0 1, and Thacko. So, let's see which one of them will claw their way out and get another shot at the winner's bracket. So, it looks like K4M0 actually took the, took the win over Abernack. So, they advance on. Oh. And you up next against Eldiff. The the cat you know the <laughs> the normal the one. War matchup. <laughs> yeah, there you go. I can't think of the right word for that. Yeah, my good old practice partner. I oh boy, I'm gonna get hit by so many DPs. Well, I shall be back. Alright. Go ahead and push out the announcement so they can oh, wrong no name. We have two no names. <laughs> Make sure I tag the right one. On it. Yep, got the names on the right side. So we got the classic matchup between these two, and Eldiff is running Troubleshooter. Eldiff crosses back between a lot of characters. I know he has the Grappler, he has a, a Crusader. I think he also has a Berserker too. Here we go. I was going to round start. Back there to catch up. <laughs> Are you? All right, starting up in the corner. Doesn't block the high. All right, keeping the damage simple until the nutter switch. Oh, got the hit for Went for the instant overhead setup anyway. Yep. Oh, unfortunately. 
Because it's not going to kill, but he got... Sometimes he... I don't know why, but he crosses out of the corner with that. Nice roll. Nice to be able to get through the, the shotgun blast. All right, round one to no name. Oh, try the TV right there in that gap. There goes a good 50% right here. All right, what's the mix? I'm guessing high. Oh, he went empty. Looks like he went empty jump. I would have got hit. Oh, jump back in eight. All right, we drink up. Nice. He's ready for that. Another DP. All right, no name takes the first one. Oh, clip by that. Because he dashed up, he ended up getting crossed up there. All right, block the DP. Time to get it in. 5D starter as well. That should be a chunk of damage. Oh, but he drops it again. That's fortunate. Did not have the conversion to keep the pressure going. Nice, nice movement right there for No Name. Oh, got the short. This time he blocks it instant overhead. Got the conversion. Nice, OTG. Finishing it with a 2A. Wow, the grenade clashed with the fireball right there. All right, time to guess. Oh, just didn't block. And nice hit confirm right there from No Name. Oh, I dropped it again. Oh no, he got him with top light right there. Oh, another drop. And they'll just turn this around. Oh, also a good start. Oh, did it too late, but he wakes up the DP. Doesn't matter. Nice conversion right there. No name takes the second game. answer right there Yes. No, no, we DP through that. All right, first round goes to Elder. Got to pick up. Pick up the five A starter, so they didn't get that much damage off of it. Good double block, but doesn't block the low. Going back for the ride again, cutting it short because of mana. Try to roll out, but no name is ready. Nice. Hit him with that perfect. All right, set point right now for no name. And they'll just turn this around. Nice carry right there. Like like I said, like Dragonite. Yeah, it's a ton of like wall-to-wall -wall carry combos. Oh, 
Yeah, that's enough. Even with the cross under like that. Oh. Nice roll to the grab. No name takes it. 3 0. Dances on the winner's finals play. We in. Updated. On to the next round. GG's to Eldith. I was constantly one step away from dying a death to a thousand DPs. So we're gonna get That's Eldith up. right back on. So it's gonna be him versus K4MO or M0. I gotta so how right. if you in the chat, how you how do you actually pronounce that? Like is it camo? And just with cause the numbers throwing me off. I always assumed it was lead speak, it was just camo, but... Okay. Yeah, camo. Okay. Alright, appreciate okay. it. Alrighty. That's what we... Okay. So, camo, so camo versus Eldo fucking... next. Uh, looks like there's a lot of rollback on Eldo Sun, unfortunately. Hopefully this next match has a better connection. They also Man, have both you too, so that's that's a closer set for them. True. So Camo is rocking. Was it Hitman, or am I thinking someone else? Yes, I believe it was. Okay. Hitman. Okay. So both of the uh, agent subclasses, by the looks of it, so this will be interesting. Yeah, both of these characters getting a ton of extra damage on Awakening, especially a troubleshooter. Like people sleep on troubleshoot troubleshooter damage. Like it may not be Dragonite damage most of the time, but holy, <laughs> it is a chunk and a half. <laughs> oh, a Swift Master. Uh oh. All right, been a minute since we've seen one. <laughs> yup, I remember you were telling me a long time ago about. How the way you beat Swiftmasters that they just get kind of cocky with their buttons, so... Yeah. Let's see if the same thing happens here. Alrighty. Yup, round start 5B. Yeah, that forward skill from Swiftmaster, really good string ender, but at certain distances, you can actually roll through the second hit and, uh... Punish him for it. Oh, does he got the combos? Oh, he's got the VNBs. Yup. Spent it all into the. Oh, drops it right at the end, though. Oh, no, it doesn't get the setup. Yup, gets caught by the third hit. Oh, that's big oh. damage, but. Oh, Elvis drops doesn't get off of it. Oh no. Oh yeah. Oh, he's got Awakening. If he doesn't drop this, he finishes it. Oh, that's over. Yo. Six damage on supers for the end. This match combos are damage. so long. Yeah. They, they really are. And his damage is pretty high too. It's not absurdly high, but for how consistent it is and how you can get it anywhere on screen, it is pretty absurdly high. Yup. Doing the corner combos mid-screen, the Swiftmaster Classic. <laughs> and it was like yeah, that, that ender, he did the 2B too low, so he couldn't get the, the ender for it. Yeah, couldn't get the tap afterwards. Yeah, and like I said earlier, the double hurricane. The range is very dependent on whether that move is good or not. Ooh, that 5B. Eldest rocking that uh, damage boost, but honestly, I don't think he'll be able to utilize it at this rate. Yeah, especially if we do the Tornado Ender. Uh, yep. Game one goes to Camo. Yep. Yeah, that is very tough. I think if Eldest picks up on that double hurricane string ender, he might be able to do something about it. 
Because if you block the second hurricane, Swiftmaster is almost always plus. Yup, running 5B. That button just goes so far, but the best part about how fast the Swiftmaster is and how much it moves forward during it. So. Oh, it drops the Ender though. Probably didn't have mana for it. Yeah. Alright. See if he gets the setup this time. Yeah, it keeps running out of mana. The one part about being that high health in this game is that you just don't have access to a ton of mana. Which, to be fair, Swift Master doesn't really need a ton of mana to get going, so. No. They, you know, it's almost, they almost just like fucking Dragonite, where mid combo, they're gonna build, build him on the back. Nah, especially Dragonite Awakening, holy. <laughs> Yo, the grenade. Ooh, yeah, that grenade is such a good move. It covers so much of the space. It's like a discount Dragonite JS. Oh no. Cancels on the first hit instead of the second. It doesn't get the combo. That DP. Very slow to start up as well, just like you're talking about uh, a launcher earlier, but it sucks you in. Alright, there we go. Okay. Do I just get this going now? Yep. Ooh. Oh, drops the combo. Tap is that move that does uh, the straightforward punch is yeah. for some reason plus on block, which is. <laughs> I don't think you'll ever utilize the plus frame because of the pushback, but it is pretty. Oh! Oh, wait. I think if that connected, that would be over. Yeah. I'm respecting the third hit. Nice! Ooh, yup. Gets greedy for the 5B, Eldith managing to take it. Oh wow, that was a lot of stagger. Oh no, it doesn't look to the toes. Oh, that's, that's oh, definitely oh, a mistake. No. Yup. Unfortunately, it's a good Pretty sure that situation where you know you're trying to input it properly, but it's like priority to the shortcuts take over. Yup. The input system giveth, the input system taketh away. <laughs> yup. Double Hurricane, a really good string after, but if he would have went the two way after that jump in, he would have comboed after that. Yeah, missing out on some damage there. That four magic skill. Ooh, this is that's it. Holy, I saw the the five S or the chunk away. And I was like, oh no, that does way more damage than I thought it would. <laughs> All right, well, looks like camo up to O. See if uh, Eldest can show some signs of life and bring it back here. Oh, nice. Ooh. And he's able to pick up with the grenade this time. Oh, and that's simple confirm. Look at it. Just refresh his health bar. Very low health character. 850, I believe. Tied for lowest in the game. I was just trying to throw out that 5B, but it has a lot of startup. Oh, I guess the clean input on it, too. Oh, drops it. So you're still hitting the 2B too low. It's, it's the same situation yeah. with um, Ghost, Ghost Blade. If you hit the 2B too low, you won't be able to get the, the Ender. Yeah, that's all the ground too early. This might oh. actually be enough. If he optimizes, yeah. One more hit yep. for that? Yes, sir. Wow. Swiftmaster really able to close it out very well thanks to his uh, very consistent damage. Ooh, gets a 5B. Oh, so that is a combo. Yep. That is, that's, that's a very new round. I don't think I've seen that before. Oh, he's popping out too early. Yep. 5B. I thought she wasn't in awakening. Ooh, it looks like he will live this though. Just barely. Nah, no, one more after that. Yep. 
I don't think I've got right on one of those yet. Well, Camo taking a 3 0, showing a very dominant Swiftmaster. Making great use of that 5B. Okay, so we're going to move on to the loser semis. We're going to have Camo staying on against two in one, which they had its rematch from the first round. Yep. So two and one rocking the launcher. So that's going to be a pretty uphill battle because if Swiftmaster just throws up summon swords, uh, it's kind of over. But granted, two and one one actually took it against, you know, the first round. Maybe it was tournament nerves, but um, they took it three one. Yeah, so let's see if two and one has the secret matchup knowledge. I mean, it's a manageable, it's not fun, but playing a launcher, it is a manageable matchup. It's just not fun. Like, you you have to be you on point with problem. everything. Yeah, you do have that 5A, correct? The really yeah. beefy 5A, so that definitely helps in footsies. Then, it, then it's also the Swift Master doesn't, because there's not many launchers anymore, so the Swift Master doesn't know the launcher matchup, then they can get caught with the flamethrower a lot. That is true. Launcher really fell off after the early stages. Yeah, everybody realizes it's not. It's so like she's fun. <laughs> she can win, but so much work to win that a lot of people's like, I don't want to do it. Just too many interactions. Like, I don't. I like the game. I don't want to play it that much though. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nice roll. Uh -oh. Yeah, rolling through the uh, launcher stuff is very deadly. So, oh. Oh no! That's the, the, no. the missile sitter. <gasps> Oh, that, that doesn't go away. So many of one watching are so distance dependent. And if she's too far away, if you roll, you can punish her like that. It's really tough. The camo isn't quite delaying its strings enough to get the combo to connect. Yup, there it is. Right. Oh. See, the answer to that is 5S. They call it Colgate. It looks like the Colgate toothpaste. <laughs> um, that, that blows away um, the Gucci belt. But the problem is, Swiftmaster still can just run through because it's just eating them. Just, you know, just eating the hits for him. Yup. So it becomes who, who's going to who's wants to use that meter most. Yup. Oh, he can take oh. from that. Yeah. Oh. If that's nice road, that's a new round. Yup. I can't wait. It's showing some uh, matchup familiarity with rolling through your strings, which is going to be very tough for Tomb 1 to adapt to. Oh? Nice dash up. Oh! oh cut it too short, but he's... Oh, some unfortunate drops. So the 236, the 236 two, MP, it, it has suction on it. So if you, if you don't roll it properly, you will get grabbed into it. Yup. Even if you try and jump over it, sometimes it'll just get vortexed in. Oh no! Got saved by the roll. Camo took the roll, but didn't quite make it. Yeah, it's looking like what's happening. Camo doesn't really understand how to deal with launcher. Nice roll. Oh, unfortunately, he get with the zone. the flamethrower. Yeah, it has a huge ass dead zone for some reason. Yeah, that's just pain. Quite literally at this point, that damage. Then what it feels like the developers was terrified of launcher being too strong, so they over nerfed it before the game came out. <laughs> there was someone at the arts. There's got to be someone at the arts' office that just uh, godlike with these low tier low tier characters. Like we can't let them. We can't let them win. Oh wait. Yep. Here, let me see. Low health. There. Yep. We were seeing earlier that uh, Cam was trying to set up the Gucci belt like you called it earlier. I love that. I'm going to call it that from now on. <laughs> and uh, yeah, Tune One was st actually interrupting the startup because it does have a decent amount of startup, but not a lot of characters are able to uh, abuse that fact. But it seems that Launcher is one of the few that can. Oh, starts out with Nuke? Very expensive, but definitely a good That's show for work. Opting not to go for the whole for the ender. Ah, oh, drops it. 
does keep Kano out of Awakening, though, and Swiftmaster, on paper, like, well, I mean, Awakening abilities are speed boost, they can't be that bad, right? Until in five frames he's across the screen in your face, like, oh, it is that bad. So right there, he tried to do, um, 6S twice. He should have just did the, the Koge, that would have shut down the coup right there, see? It, they call it Koge Two Pace, and it looks like like the, the stream Koge. <laughs> it really does, and that does delete all the tornadoes, correct? Yeah. No, it, it yeah. When you, when you run into Gucci Belt, it does delete it, but he can just run through it. So it's it's like do you you do it based on distance? Oh uh, yeah, because they're too close, they can punish it. Yep. Okay. Nice pick Ooh. up with Flamethrower. Doing one turn to catch up on all the rolls that Cam was doing. Oh, the double throw works every time. Oh, look, trying to go for another one. Oh, that oh, is a dead touch? Yeah. Man, that's unfortunate. Ooh. Pretty much majority of her moves, if, it, if you buy the barrel, you won't get in. Man, that is unfortunate. You think you should get hit by the barrel too? <laughs> you think they'd give her that luxury? Wow, caught him Perfectly not blocking. Is DP? Oh, like you said, doesn't roll it properly. Like you said. Oh, the anti-air charge shot. That was nice right there with the two one four MP. Like it, it, it can work as the anti-air sometimes. Like Sagat, uh, high fireball. It is very high up, but. Ooh, DP. Oh, good roll, but wasn't ready for the punish. Okay. That was a mistake. He wanted a 2 3 6. Yeah, I'm trying to get some pressure, but. Oh, I guess the orb I'm out. Getting... Oh, no guess, it's DP. Oh, the Colgate, getting some damage in. Oh, oh that's the game! Oh! What? That was almost really bad. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that was almost really bad. All right, 2 and one, one keeping it even with 1-1. One, one. Oh, 2 and 1-1, one, one. that's <laughs> It took me a bit to realize. Yeah, it looks like, yeah, like he said, 2 one one definitely doing very well here. Also, a lot of this is just like a matchup knowledge check for Camo right now. Yeah, it seems like Camo's getting really greedy with the rolls and 2 one one just throwing out the There's a grenade. And... The grenade is so good in a lot of situations. Yeah, it can lead to some setups, right? Yep. Cause you know, in this game when it comes to grenades, they stay active even if you get hit. That is true. And if you, she does, and if she does grenade, and you try to jump up, she can actually punish you with five AA. And you land right into grenade. That's and that's gonna hurt. Oh, this might kill. Uh, oh, this does kill. Oh, but he drops it. But he gets yo. Oh, oh, the deadly messed up. drop. Oh, two on one has another ch has another chance. Too far, too far. That's it. Yep. It's a delay to cast the roll, but it doesn't work out. So what happened with the two nukes? Um, two one one was mashing deep, like the shortcut DP. So if you yep. do it when you're in the air, the nuke will come out. Yeah, that's See, right that there, is the grenade about. is like so good in a lot of situations, especially off knockdown. Yeah. Oh, DP's through it. Yeah, two one really just got to start locking him down with five AA to keep him from rolling. Cause Camus has been kind of rocking with the roll. Cause like, I mean, hey, when it works once, I win. Not to mention, when you do damage, it doesn't really matter. Cause I can do twice as much damage. <laughs> Told him not block it again. Uh, you won't. You won't walk forward. Wait, but this it should be it doesn't drop it. Oh yeah. Yup. That magic cylinder doing so much chunky damage. 
Alright, 2-1. Camo's favor. Let's see if 2 one can pull it out. That 5A reaches so far. Fucking a lot. I would want to grab again. Oh yeah. Rolls through it. Oh, looks like Camo's respecting the pressure a bit more now. But immediately gets thrown. Right to the nuke. Ooh, catch the round. jump if he doesn't drop it. Oh, the oh, no. Commentator's curse. <laughs> It still takes. I, was that a perfect? Yeah, it was a perfect. Camo stopped blocking it. He's picking it up. You know, he expected the round to be over. Yep. Yeah. Oh, punish on the 4S. Ooh. Bad way to start. You lose 60% health. Yo, oh, doesn't go for the. Okay, get some space. Get some area to work with. Yeah, looks like Human is doing a lot of buffering with that string. Oh, yep, tries to throw, but exchanging some DPs. <laughs> Getting a little too cheeky when it comes to the run of grab, so Camel's starting to pick up on it. Yup. This might be over for 201. Should be. Oh, yup. Yes, sir. Lots of damage. Camo the crazy thing is, he has all, all day to, like, OTG with that. It's just... <laughs> so much time. He's on the, you're on the floor for a long time. Back to the laser. Road properly. This could be the end for our low tier hero. Yup. Like that, he went for the end jump and tried to bait the DP. Oh! Gets caught in the roll startup by the looks of it. But. Oh, the vacuum saved him! Oh, the custom rolling right now. Yup. But 2 oh, one will have to mix it up because. He, yeah. He's, so, he, yeah, he's. Camo's looking for the roll yeah. opportunity. And unless we see a drop, that's it. Oh! oh. Tournament nerves! Yep. Oh, he oh, puts look, it. Yep. Uh -oh. Gets the bait and the punish. They were taking a 3 1. A reversal of their last. Uh, Exchange, yeah, it actually was. So. It's like Camo moving on. Good stuff Seems. to Camo making it to lose the finals. Yup. So you up again and win this finals now. Against Reeland, correct? That is correct. Alrighty, I will be back. Right, rolling right into winners finals. So I wonder if really is gonna to switch to the Ranger finally, or he's gonna stick with the Hitman, because the Hitman's been carrying him kind of you know majority of the way through. Good showing from two and one one. Appreciate you stopping by, appreciate you participating. That's the launcher. I, I love seeing a launcher. I still got much love for launcher. I'm waiting for the patch. Hopefully the patch does something to Launcher to bring her more mid-range. Or top tier. I would take her being top tier too. Alright, here we go. Launcher is love. Save Launcher for real. <laughs> Caught him with the DP. Nice safe shot right there to bait the DP in return. Doing more, yes sir. Trying to guess. Oh, nice wins there, exchange. Oh, it drops it. Lands right into the DP. Oh, caught him pushing buttons with the six S. All right, round one goes to Rian. 
Nice whiff punch right there, but he cuts it short. A lot of drops right now. I was say, look like he blocked it, but he cost him up. Did jump? I knew it. I called it. I called it in the jump. I love the stare down. Like, what you gonna do? I'm not gonna do nothing. You gonna do nothing? Boop. Hit him with the DP. Control the neutral. Nice. The DP was ready. Alright, game one goes to Rian. Wondering Zombie, appreciate the follow. Welcome to the squad. So we're going right back into it. Nice DP is like, I don't care about your pressure. We're going in. Nice pick up. Drops it again, but gets the instant overhead. And we getting the mana back to make this hurt. Drops another drop. Ooh. Make it hurt. Oh, he didn't have to go for the DG right there. This might be enough to take the round. Oh. Like he fell out of the combo, but he wasn't ready to block. Got those American resets. Nice. Rian's ready for a lot of the mix-ups that um, no one ain't trying to do. Has a DP on deck. I'm gonna try to roll out, but gets flipped with the jump. He like that. The be game right here. Oh, didn't do the right route, so if we don't do the proper route right there, should've just cut it short. Block the DP, that's it. All right, game two goes to Rian. And looking real strong right now. All right, block to take that start. Gets clipped, but he wasn't ready for the combo after that. Oh, caught him blo blocking. Time to guess. Oh, doesn't guess right. Just took with the jump A. All right, but no one ain't get the combo this time. Oh, no, he doesn't. Come take his curse. I'm just going to stop talking my combos. Oh, nice. It's an overhead. That was super low, too. That was disgusting. Not in the wakening, so could not get the kill off that. Oh, the homie. Oh, no. He's... He, he, oh, he wasn't ready to combo. He didn't expect to hit him with that. That's unfortunate. It looks like No Name forgot about the homies too. Like he just tried to dash forward to punish. Nice roll. All right, No Name's waking up. Big drop. Caught him dancing over it again. That is, especially with the dragon going, it's really hard to see. But the homies are out. We're going right to the super. Keep it simple. Right now, Green. No one ain't trying to fight for his life. Nice roll. He's ready now. Waking up. Going to 
mix. Goes high again. If he's ready. Whoa, nice. The dragon kept him safe. Even though he... I wonder if that actually added skill into it. Because it looks like he probably would have got more with a 5D starter instead of dragon starter. Try to go for the into jump this time. Blocks the instant overhead. Oops. Oh, nice conversion himself to keep himself safe. All that white health right now. Slowly letting the build back. Grab. The tension right now. Gets enough homies. Conversion. Oh, one of scoops. Got him in the corner. Oh no! The run up nothing sakes it. Green advances to grand finals. We uh, took a little break in there to uh, <laughs> just uh, kind of sit there if you saw that. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't want to do anything. He didn't want to do anything. It was a stalemate. <laughs> GG's. All right, homie. So you're now in the losers finals. Up against man. Camel. You get... Oh, no. Well, Swift Master it is. I will right, good luck. probably be back. Thank you. Don't say probably. <laughs> <laughs> Got to go in with more confidence than that. Got to go in with your chest out. We are now in losers finals. Camo versus No Name. A Dragonite versus Swiftmaster. Everybody set, character selected, so we're just gonna hop right into it. I know that he's going to deal with Swiftmaster. Nice, that's going for the loop. The patience right there is trying to bait the DP. There it is. Oh, oh fell out too quick. Oh, not a bad DP right there. Oh, bad drop. I'm gonna guess. No, we don't guess. We got DP throws. Oh no, the two A. All right, round one goes to Camo. Wow, run up 5B. This is gonna hurt a lot. Right into the instant overhead. Caught him crouching. Oh, that was a bad drop right there. Yes, sir, to keep going. Oh, bad. Wolf Punish on the 5D. I'm always ready. This should be game. Oh, he was doing too much. He was too much. Oh, that's unfortunate. Right into the super, right? Yes, sir. He should have just went right into his own super. Oh, another drop. Are you getting the tournament nerves going on right now? Oh, we in there with the 5B. Went up 5B. Could actually do a chunk of damage. Oh, 
Oh, this is not black eye. I'm like that. The no name takes the first game. Try to go for a safe jump, but push the button at the last second and got clipped to DP. Got him another DP. Another drop, that's unfortunate. Alright. Yeah, he's ready with the dragon punch. He's like, no, I'm not, I don't want to guess right now. Going in for the ender. Oh, cuts it short this time. Just not trusting himself. Otherwise, he would have been able to. Yep, got the kill anyway. Nice chase down. Oh, bad drop. This time, block the DP. Oh. Block the. Actually, it's no head, but didn't fall off the low. Nice base going on right now. Got a lot of resets. Should be round. Alright, gonna get it this time. Pushing it to the corner. Oh, whiffs the grab, but no punish. Wasn't ready for it. Oh, knocks him out of the jump. You got a DP for your troubles. Nice. That's so mis uh, misleading. You think you could punish, but nope. It is still his turn when he does that. Wow, the autocorrect on the DP right there. Nice. Camo's on the board. It's one apiece now. Oh, nice roll right there past the 5B. Base the um, BP. All right, here we go. Could have got the cross under, but opted just to go for the easier combo. Got him with the grab. Oh, nice air there. Jump A, but wasn't ready for the DP. Wow, wasn't blocking. Should be round. All right, don't, don't ain't take first blood for the round. Nice chase down. This time gets conversion. Cuts it short. Run out of mana. Nice counter grab right there. So recognize the gap, so I'm running for it. Good roll right there from No Name. You're like, try to run up 5B again. Oh, bad drop right into the DP. We don't scramble. Good patience with no name. Realizing they're both scrambling hard right now. All right, two to one, no name. Oh, stars are 5B. No name, opposite block. Good checks from Camo. What he drops it again. Doesn't matter if we do Swiss Master Games with the 2B. Nice 
Grab. Gets him in the corner. Jump. Look himself available for the DP. Oh, the second fireball hit him. Another block. This might kill. This is gonna kill. Look at that damage. Didn't even need the super. Yo, no name had me scared though. Like he could have just went into the super earlier. Nope, you gotta get that swag combo in there. Nice roll through the, the last two tornadoes. Nice check from Camo with the 5B. Flag time. Nice wake up DP. He's like, no. Got him with another one. Reacting to the 5B. Nice run grab. Face the DP again. That looks like a GG's. No name takes it. 3 1. No name advances on to grand finals from the loser side. Oh, GG's. I got the shaky hands going to grand finals, so let's pray that works <laughs> out. <laughs> well, looking forward to it, Rila. Let's, uh, let's go. There we go, the brackets updated. And just waiting for them to come in. So we get the character select. So, Grand Final. So, those who are unfamiliar with the setup, no name is in the loser side. So, he has to win six times. That's six times to get it. So, you get three times for the bracket reset, and then another three times to take it. Otherwise, we're in because he's coming from the winner side. He's coming from the top. He just needs three and he closes everything out and he going with his main bread and butter right now. They try to secure the win. All right, let's see how this goes. A nice basic DP got in with OTG. Oh, whip the, whip the combo though. Are you in there? Oh, tries to punish. Look at this damage. All right, living on a pretzel. Nice kind of grab. Got him in the corner now. Oh, good patience for Rian. Realizing right there, didn't want to scramble. This should be death. Alright, round one goes to Rian. I was trying to roast through, but get him in humble state right there. Yo, the stare down again to the grab. Oh, caught him jumping. Nice fly right there. Knew he was in a bad situation, so flight kept him safe. Did not want to catch on the double overhead setup. Oh, just jumped completely over him. Oh, shot the dragon. Nice. Not going to let you start. This is not going to kill because of the starter. Oh, nice counter grab. Man takes first blood, is on the board with the first win.
Your blocks. But that the dragon covering them making it easy for the tick throw setup. Slowly rolling in. This time he times the DP right just to punish right. But oh, nice roll right there. Green is doing an excellent job of keeping no name out. I liked it. No name tried to bait the DP right there. Green is ready. Oh, and bad drop. Clipped him right out of the air. Alright, round one goes to Rian. Oh, and he got clipped with the grenade right there. Oh, no. He still has the follow up after that. Gotta respect it. I love the delay. Trying to bake the DP right there. Blocks him. How much can he get off this? Can he make it hurt? Oh, he might be dead. Oh, he's dead. Wow, that looks like 80% right there. Wow, what an answer right there for no name. <laughs> the long, like, ride out with the fly. Oh, drops the combo. Nice bait on DP. Alright, this is gonna hurt. Wow, smooth 60%. Nice tech right there. Does a second, second grab attempt, but does roll. Oh, nice chase down with the 5B. No name came with really it. Ended in going. Rian is ready to counter the dragon anytime the dragon comes through. Oh, lands right on the gun. Nice pickup from Rian. That is an insane pickup from Rian right there. Wow, that punishes that too? Okay. <laughs> nice answer right there. Sorry, we ain't nothing. No name makes this happen. Oh. What? Nice counter grab. Oh, trying to go for grab. Too much hit sign, though. Feel my turn. I got conversion to keep it safe. Oh, got the instant overhead. This might be the round. He got two. Oh, he drops it. That's unfortunate. That would have been around right to the DP. What an unfortunate drop right there. Instead, Rian now is sitting on tournament point. Wow, I answered your DP with my own. 
Nice chase down from the road. I'm guess. Good block right there. Good patience. Oh, caught him trying to jump out of it. Nice. He's catching him on the road every time. Oh, he drops it. That is so unfortunate. Doesn't matter. Panic DP. I know that still trying to fight to stay alive. We ain't still sitting on tournament point right now. Oh, nice roll, roll through there. All right, no, they ain't getting it started. Nice, 50%. Oh, messes up the setup. Nice counter grab. Oh, the slow approach. What was that? Oh, caught him just trying to jump up. Is that, a, that gonna be enough? It is not enough. To be it right here, yes, sir. Hey, no man gets on the board. It is now 2-1. Straight to the character switch. Well, not the hitman. He's like, let me close this out. I'm starting to figure out my range, my ranger. A right, nice pickup, no name, starting to wake up. Let's go. Time to guess. The blocks his patience. Oh, whips the grab right there, though. Wake up, GP. Get off me. Nice, caught on mid roll. Starting to change up just a little bit, just enough to keep no name honest. Did not block the follow up off the jump B right there. All right, has to guess right this time. One more hit. All right, going for the grab. Got the homies out still. He didn't have meter. All right, round one goes to No Name. Good eye for No Name to realize he didn't have meter. Oh, wow, round start. Stagger, run up, grab. Nice roll for No Name. Nice blocks from Rian. Good patience right there. Nice DP. Pushing them off. Start off with success. Oh, no, they ain't tried to roll on reaction, but got clipped with the tail end of it. Oh, drops it. Nice punish. You were too close for that. Oh, bad. This, this might be round. Oh, no, he had to cut it short. Okay. This definitely should be round right here. Oh, cuts it short. I'm not sure. Is that enough? It, it might be enough. It might be enough. The kill? It does. Donate ties it up two games apiece. Okay. All right, we got ourselves a grand finals going on right now. Challenger, round one, fight! <laughs> 
Slam. Going for another one. Yep. Time to guess. Block both hits into the grab. Wow, the dragon saved the DP situation. Nice tech right there. No name is awake. He's watching. Oh, bad wolf right there. All right, time to guess. Going for the high. Good blocks on the instant overhead. The patience. Oh! Yo, we zoom away trying to bait the DP. Doesn't matter though. 6S chase down. All right, Rian's back on tournament point. Oh, wow. I'm not sure what he hit him out of. Nice jump in air. Like, it's like, no, you gonna stay up there? I'm gonna chase you down. The roll under. All right, let's make it hurt. Oh, bad drop. Good block on the instant overhead. Being ready. First time I see him use uh, the guard break right there. I mean, guard cancel right there. Oh, this time, no man was successful with the rollout. All right, Rian's in Awakening. It's a whole different ball game now. It's a whole different character. Oh, it doesn't block the follow-up hits. This might kill. But he cuts it short. Oh, he gets the cross-up, though. He drops it. All right, reset point. No names on reset point. Rian's on tournament point. Get strings, get patience, get tech, but it's still my turn. Oh, the dragon keeping him safe. All right, we got him in the corner. Nice roll, but he's ready. The no, has been on point when they're chasing the rollouts. Time to guess, goes high again, right into the grab. Nice tech. Wow, the patience, what's going on right now? Andy's in Awakening, better make it hurt. Gotta guess right. This time he blocks, doesn't take the grab though. Good block on the crossover, but doesn't stop the 2A. Hey. This time he keeps it simple. Calling homies again. He drops it again. All right, conversion and then the patience of, oh, the grab. Anybody's game. Just still got the homies out. Look at the chip damage. Good tech. Guess the meter still. Still patience. What's going to happen? Oh, another tech. The grab. That's ooh, so close. Homie's out. It has to meet it. So much meter. So much meter. Oh, the cross up to B. Rhea takes it. Wow, what a grand finals. Congratulations to Rhea. GG's. That was wow. a wow set. What a set you guys had. What a set. I didn't quite get the racket reset, but I forced the switch to Hitman, so I'm pretty happy with it. That yo, that that those last rounds were like <laughs> that how many techs was that? We were in each other's heads so much. <laughs> Holy Wow. Great showing that you guys. Was... Great showing. That was a great match. Good stuff to Real and everyone else in the tournament. That was a fun bracket. Holy. You alright? Yeah. You need to get a drink? You need to shake it off? <laughs> I'm gonna need to get ready for Tekken. This is gonna be a... Have some lunch, sit down, and just try and get the shakes out. <laughs> alright, homie. I appreciate you co-commentating with me. Go ahead and get your break in. I'm gonna go ahead and send things off here. Thank you very much. Have a good one, everybody. All right, everybody, appreciate you tuning in. Appreciate the follows. Will we be back at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time with some King of Fighters? So go ahead, take your break, get your lunch in. I will see you guys later.